I recognize Yiga unapologetically as an able lieutenant for fighting against Fulani imperialism. Fulani imperialism in whatever form. Don't let anybody deceive you. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a born Democrat doing everything that's undemocratic. And you people follow him, you say yes. It's because he was a ministry before. He's now a civilian. In can we tell you, don't tell me that rubbish. A feudalist is a feudalist. And that is what it is. God has made his faith. We are suffering in this country. If you really remember, want to remember Inca, fight against the priest president full and his imperialism. And let nobody deceive you by telling you it's all journey secession. Nobody is calling for a session. As Governor Fahemi said, we are not secessionists. We are the people calling for a social need to consolidate Nigerian unity. Anything outside that is fulanization. Don't, don't, don't buy anything. When I was interviewed by the BBC, so you are talking of social need. But I can't do that. So you say, no session. I know we are part of all those I said, yes. I am in complete agreement with Akere Dolu Ah, he said, how? Oh. I said, we don't want secession. To prevent secession, we search the country. The Igbo's, the Namdekanus, the Igbesus, you will continue to encourage more of them the, the more you delay to research all this country. Yeah. Those who are friends of uh, President Buhari, those who are his colleagues, tell him the greatest friend he has in this country is a very, very, and those who are preaching is such all. And I make bold, and I repeat, Buhari is number one element of Nigerian unity. The moment he delays the structure in this country now, <laughs> he is giving impetus to the goals, to the full Nigerians. Uh, we have war for the unity of this country. When many of these people are in the school, if you say something now, they say. Is his speech. But I'm ready to be caught for his speech. I'm just speaking the truth. I'll be talking federalism, unity of Nigeria. When those who now say to the social, it's to, it's to, it's to, it's to, it's to, it's to separate the country. Who are you talking about? And don't allow anybody to change the narrative. Oh, they say the oh, flag must go. Oh, they are going to lie. They say they must do. We don't ask the Fulani to go. We ask the Fulani arms men who are raping our women, who are seducing us, who are coming our, our farms, who are killing us, depriving our, our farmers of their farmland. Those are the Fulani to go. And whenever they tell you that, have we ever asked Dangote to go? Is Dangote not full of money? Is employment, giving employment, improving the economy? And we can't be, we can't be black way. If you ask full money to go, we ask all the southerners in the north to come home. And I ask them, which Yoruba man, Igbo man, that is raping your women? That is kidnapping your people. Which your bad man has gone to Kaduna to plant cocoa because he has the right to be anywhere in the country. God that has. Tell them we are no fools. 
they don't want the criminals among them to go. And they should make bold to arrest the criminals and tell them, don't give us a, uh, a bad name. Rather than saying you are, you are generalizing. These are the things that you can fall for relentlessly. Telling the bad that they don't change the narrative. The narrative is the criminal fully to go. And we repeat it. Is that Zenik, Yoruba, Igbo, Ijo, in the north, doing the same thing, send them away. We have fought for this country to be united for progress, not for a section of the country to oppress us. We don't want the unity of the country where there will be unity of the horse and the rider, and they will be the rider and we will be the horse.